Okay, guys, so we're going to read this Bernstein book, and the letter is A. Okay, let's turn the page. And the first thing we okay. see, and this is ants. Ants. Unless like she's scared of it. <gasps> ants. Now there's more ants. Angry ants advance. Look at all those ants. See, there's a lot of ants. They're angry. Across an apple. Look at all those ants walking on top of the apple. What? Did I take an apple? Let's see. Across an acorn. Angry ants advance across an apple and an acorn. Oh my goodness, look, there's a lot of them. Across an apricot, an axe, and an angle worm. Why do angry ants advance across an apple, an acorn, an apricot, an axe, and an angle worm? Let's see what the answer is. Angry ants advance across an alligator in Aunt Alice's airplane. What? And across Avenue A, angry ants advance across apes' apartments. Look at all those apes. And the ants are still walking. And all Arizona? Why do angry ants advance across an apple, an acorn, an apricot, an axe, an angleworm, an alligator? On Alice's airplane, Avenue A, at Apes Apartments, and all Arizona. Ah, an ant eater and an ant hill. Wow. Attack. Ah. Ooh, look, the ants are going to eat the ant eater. The ant eater. Let's see what it says here. That's why angry ants advance across an apple, an acorn, an apricot, an axe, an angleworm, an alligator on Alice's airplane, Avenue A, apes, apartments, and all around Arizona. Ants are amazing. The ends. That a fast one. Yeah, this was a fast book. How did I die? Bye.